Hey guys, we're just uh, having some Liu Bao today. We have three Liu Bao lined up uh, from different years, 2014. Uh, another one is 2007, and uh, the oldest is from 1992. 92? Yeah, and it was given. Uh, didn't got a chance to and, try it. Uh, those are the dates after the five years of bamboo, right? Mm, let me ask. Okay. Ours, okay. for sure. Okay. Mm, so both should be all of them. Okay. Yeah. I think that's normally how they date mm -hmm. you know about shot, right? Okay. So this is infusion number one, I guess, obviously. Of right. the three Liabao Cha tasting. One of them is ours? So, there is the liquor. I'm not sure how well you guys can see it. Pretty dark, huh? Really dark. So smelly smell. Yeah, 2014, 07, and 90, 92. I started with the 92. Yum. So this is the. Fourteen, I think. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. It's not like a It's still one for me, right? Thanks. Mm. Thanks. Mm. All right. Much different than the liquor. The liquor is uh, sweet, full. A little bit of date sweetness, a little bit of wood. Not too earthy, but more high than wood. I really like that. So this is the uh, 2007. Yeah, we should... Um, this one rendered re much darker liquor. The, uh, the 14 was uh, in the sort of typical reddish, deep red color. And this one is, uh, I have to say, it's pretty much dark brown. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. What is that? That smell is it, like... Liquor has like a, this is going to sound weird, but almost like a turning strawberry, just about to go rotten, has that slight alcohol smell and a hint of strawberry. Really strawberry. interesting. Not fresh though, about to go rotten. <laughs> a little bit like, a little bit zesty on, like a little bit spritzy on the nose. Mm, really 
interesting. This is drier. Mm-hmm. Uh, really delicious, much more earth. Did you get a chance to try it? Uh, okay. oh. No, I didn't try it yet. So this is our tea, and this one was given to us the same as the uh, Hong Kong Dance on the 580 we call. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, it was given to us recently. This one was given to us in 2007, and uh, at that time it has been about one or two years. Trembles Third one was similar to the second one, but uh, I found it a little bit dirtier. Uh, to say more, even more earth. The third one? Um, I don't know, the second one, I want to say it was thinner, which isn't a very nice thing to say, but it didn't have a thin mouthfeel, but the flavor was more delicate. Mm -hmm. It still lingered, it tastes really good, much more earthy than the first one. But the second two have similar flavor profile to me, mm -hmm. more of an earthy element. What are your thoughts? My thought? It's a really interesting tea. Uh, I would expect the 92 to be a little bit more delicious, more aged flavor, while the second one, um, when I just saw the liquid, I didn't like the color, like the look of the liquid because it's so dark, I don't see much lustrous and that's kind of clearest of the uh, liquor mm -hmm. so I was like hmm that's some it's weird and the smell is so strong like Asian flavor but this one is very short on our hand in Beijing for at least 10 years with a mm, couple of more years before we got it so we don't know when this tea comes to the north, when this tea came to the north, right. it, it was given to us recently. Right, but this one did most of its aging in the north, yes. you were saying. And ten, like we we're pretty sure about 10 years, that's why we marked like 2007. Now we know there were a couple of years before it got to us. But. Which is interesting. <laughs> Another interesting thing is the uh, the flavor of the first one, now that I've had the second two, reminds me of our 2015 Shupuar a little bit. It has a little bit more clay element in it now. Which it, one? This one? No, the first one. The first one. Oh, yeah. okay. The, the, my first taste of it didn't have that. It was sweet, date, uh, really delicious. It's still really delicious, but after having the older ones, I can taste its, sort of its youth again, I kind of think. That, um, yeah, I don't know if that's the right word, but for me it's almost like clay. I used to call it Play Doh, but that sounds awful. Right. I would expect this tea to have a stronger flavor from this tea. Because if this, this is from 2007, or say 2005 ish, and this one's from 1992, shouldn't that be, you know? 
Here's how I found them. I found the 92 tastes stronger, but was less powerful, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. It had more of a coffee feel in my mouth, mm -hmm. really coated my mouth. But when I first saw the liquor, I was like, oh, that really looked like a fake tea. But in 2007, there's no point in faking it. Well, it wasn't a popular or a big money maker yet. Right. Still not much of a money maker now, but the same reputation. So you lay down cleanser, it's a cleanser, I choose a toy, it has a mock la corny, the corny little bit of a matter of a sound little bit of a I got it a little bit like a woody camphor and um, a plum. Yeah, dry this has plum. A, yeah, it has a nice little fruity note. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's the age, but I definitely feel like the middle one is a cleaner, more refreshing. Um, these two are more similar to each other than this one, though, by a mm. lot. Right. Um, like a seaweed plus a dry bamboo leaves. On the first one? I feel. Yeah. I'm just a really like, um, fascinated by that kind of liquor and stuff. Mm -hmm. It's really not a pretty liquor for me. Mm -hmm. so, so heading into Infusion 3, um, all of us a little bit shocked, probably not as much as Jen, by the uh, color of the liquor of the second one. We'll give you a glimpse at it this time. Uh, it's just really dark, uh, brown. Yeah, like the soy sauce. Like what? Soy sauce. Yeah, like soy sauce, yeah, right, that's right. right. It doesn't have that bright um, lustrousness we talk about. It should be radiant, clear, red in the case of this kind of a tea, or red-brown. This one is leaning heavily, more like a brown-red, mm -hmm. right? Uh, almost like, a, well, not so dark as a, as a coffee, but, but towards that. Yeah, uh, really dark. It's typically not desired in, a, in the brewed liquor, but... I found it quite tasty, number two. I prefer it over number three, which is supposedly uh, older. I just found it wasn't as aggressive as a flavor. Uh, once it's in my mouth, it was... Uh, yeah, number three is a little bit plant for me as the tea from 1992. Mm -hmm. I got really... Plain, like a very predictable profile. Is that what you mean by um, plain? I would actually say this one tastes more like that age rather than this one. Right, that's you know? how it helps you. Only because this one we're sure about to 2007 to mm -hmm. 2017. Uh -huh. So which makes this tea a really interesting one. The whole whole flavor is getting dull a little bit. Like fading away or mm -hmm. something like that. Also, I've had the opposite experience in my mouth than what we see on the liquor. I found the dark, dark liquor cleaner and more with a bit more complexity. I found the lighter liquor of 92 here. One, two. Oh, let me hold this with you. Let's see. Okay. One, two, three, all together. And I found the liquor of the... I can't see what I'm doing. But... Okay. 
Yeah, well, basically yeah you, you can see, see the color the, difference. This is the lightest. Of the, this, this is ruby is red. Mine is ruby yeah. red, and the center one is really dark. And on the first infusion, it was quite a bit darker than even that. I couldn't see the table through the liquor. It was pretty much opaque. Yeah, and I use, I measure six grams. Shocking. Six grams for each? Yeah. That's how I usually do dark tea. Way too much. Although six isn't way. It's a little bit too much. Good flavor. Yeah, it's good time. Smell like more like this. Try this. This is like Yulia. Doesn't this remind you of that purple sea? Dos. Dos. Yes. I have to say I'm not getting much out of the bottom the bottom cup here. So for those of you that don't know, dulse is a purple seaweed that we eat down on the east coast. Uh, most people consider it pretty disgusting. It's, <laughs> it's sun-dried and it's very salty. It's just basically plucked and withered like white tea. It doesn't taste anything like white tea. It's so very healthy. <laughs> There's a really remarkable difference between the 14 here and the uh, the other two, and certainly the 007. Mm. I'm always saying now this smells better than the number two because the number two is more mixed, not so pure. I love it's m more obvious, but this one is some, like a subtle, elegant, and, you know, soft and pure kind of smell. Which I, I feel is like a powerless. <laughs> It's possible, right? Did we we gave these a rinse, I guess? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I like all of these teas a lot. They're mm -hmm. all uh, they're all brewing really nicely. Yeah, I should have hot pot for lunch now. Whenever I have dark tea now, I start to feel I need food. Hungry, right? Yeah, it's, it's not actually like a stomach feel hungry, it's the mind feel like to have something more flavorful too. Dirty laundry. 
Don't you know that it's on this one? That's yeah. awful, right? That first light smells a little bit like dirty laundry. In a good way, of course. No, that would be a good way. That's <laughs> what <laughs> 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 yeah. she There's no there's no recovering from that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Like someone you like sturdy laundry, not somebody disgusting sturdy laundry. That was amazing. Oh, lobo. Ah, lobo. Little bit. Yeah. Yesterday was a tong hao. It's all based on what you have for lunch. Yes, I think maybe could just be based on my lunch. Drama says Henry is a story. Hmm. Drama means that the drama is still. Lobo ma, so when it's hot, the lobo way ma, so the hot the hot the hot the hot. Forward。所以你也是去把大量的米摆在那个火里，然后放上了，而且从中间米摆抽出来，你肯定倒了。跟米粉肯定是那个火的吃辣的，你火的吃辣就倒下去，倒下，因为一般都吃梅子味，是生
他只要因为就是可以全国的节目，吃他走，每周回来可能四五年就吃了。我就去西藏的制作隔离，有好隔离，他能提前没那么多的，他有可能四五年去吃完了。他一八年在农村过年，就是说十年左右的草，包括普洱茶啊什么，十年左右的草我会吃，反正没事玩。也很没事玩的呢。叫个个产鲜味儿，跟就是你苦，每次个尝，学问多的明白，要对那儿产鲜味尝，学问多的明白要冲，所以各个来了。那个其实茶口出来的时候，其实是那个是有不少人做木味，有不少人卤味，有的不难。他是干啥去放啊？他就是每次来为是干，有不少人卤味。但是各个草头的那个全部的那个食食都会。你你那个鲜就会发生它的变化，对，因为开封草呢，也会有微微的那个，那因为这个呃，茶茶每种茶种在哪去的话，俺们的它都是苦苦之生的因缘是不是？它一直有的，没有泡没得泡法提提提提。你在那边做学，我搿不是有的做了五年的实验，我喝哈子，炒哈子，哎，都生的味道。有的我讲喝了三年的实验，我咋就喝哈子生的味道？搿能力差，困难去做学。让你吃这个叫吃什么不要，它是很多的错，你是没得办法去。嗯。This is starting to have a little, the second one, the O7, still earthy, clean with a little hint of a really mature red wine. 嗯，先来给喷，这是提示喷，肯定。嗯。嗯。On the wet leaf, I got. When I smell the guy one, the hot guy one, I got these two uh, pine forest floor. Not super pine, but like the floor, where it's earthy and old with a hint of pine. And I finally got the seaweed you're talking about on the on the 2014 yeah. on the uh, hot guy one. Yeah, it's really clearly like kelp, dulse. I didn't get that before at all. I think it was too cool. Possible. I'm going to feel the water. Just starting out with uh, starting up infusion number five now. Right. Mm -hmm. This is also a like learning experience for me as well because mm -hmm. when you taste the tea, you want to, especially when there's a label, you want to see uh, the ear, right? A lot of plants we taste tea, we just have a few infusions, then throw that out, but it's not just sufficient. Like when it just started, this tea was really, I call it a plant. I, just mm -hmm. And I found it had a dirty mouth feel. Right, in 92, I was like, okay, it really doesn't feel mm -hmm. that way. And this one is really interesting. Mm -hmm. Like, it starts really uh, uh, not beautiful with the liquor, the mm -hmm. smell and mm -hmm. stuff. But um, in the later infusions, this one starts to perform better. Yeah. And that aged flavor starts to come out, and this one, like, keeps that it still has that kind of dry plum flavor, mm -hmm. which is a good indication of around like 10 years old and stuff. But mm -hmm. of course, different process, different uh, factors, and you know, what's the uh, leaf material mm -hmm. will also affect how it tastes like. So right. it's like a deciding the age, not say pinpoint the year, but to say month three teas, what's the ages. Right. It's kind of a trying to- Relatively, right? Relatively, right sifting different uh, factors, yeah. right? What are the possible factors to affect the taste and mm -hmm. how mm -hmm. do you still get the idea of the age? Yeah, and especially with eight old teas like this, you can't do that in two or three infusions. They need the, the mm -hmm. space and the time to open up and... Mm -hmm. And make the money worth it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> right, right.
Oh, it's super windy outside. Mm -hmm. You go by. Mm -hmm. So right behind you guys is a giant window, and we can see the snow swirling. Mm -hmm. So I'm really glad I have some hot tea right now. <sighs> I can taste the 2014 starting to get a little bit tired. It's, it's winding down. Mm -hmm. Still really plenty of flavor, but... really interesting to see how the aroma changes, especially in these two teas. This one is pretty consistent seaweed. Healthy <laughs> dolls. Healthy, right, right. Mm -hmm. And this one had a pretty strong like from the second third to the fourth infusion. Pretty um pretty strong dry plum flavor. Why now I feel like aged the woody uh, camper flavor comes mm -hmm. out more. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And this one is Pretty consistent to that, just subtle, elegant, um, soft, aged flavor. Mm -hmm. Still pretty plummy in the liquor though. I'm still pretty impressed by the profile difference, the flavor profile from 2014 to 27, mm -hmm. from that um, sweeter flavor and the er younger tea to that really earthy, yeah, richer flavor. It's not just the age, right? Mm -hmm. There's also right. like the material, right. everything matters, yes. and also this one is the uh, age like loose leaf, and this one was the uh, still pressed. I just uh, broke this down into little chunks to brew. Uh -huh. so, that also affects of course. the process. Again, the young one is also loose leaf, right? Right. Tabi 才能你抽离的会出现一种活所以你请你一个小伙子 Zhang 
天，有的就成佛，就是传说的成佛，有些是神佛，神佛的成佛的都一腾的时间，他会不腾的，因为他的佛我都比佛很多，他是说错你要成佛的话，实际上他的那个概念跟说错的概念就基本上的差不多，是，他是形成那个个，嗯，六本草要开始了哈，或者说错的这种做法。就是不是说神的做头，就还把它变得是苦力的，也还那个苦力的发觉，基本上是要把它从苦力的面子里才能够出来嘛。就现在是这么讲的，但是现在你你现在就要全部念过的，实际上不可能这句话，就是你必须快速的传播，就适应那个时钟。嗯。一过去是中国精神食堂，中国精神食堂它就是搿种，再加上一个就是去流通运输，明白？明白？嗯。搿是铁路铺，南坡也冇过来，水多多，我出来看还是坐塘北获得。嗯。So it's just a long vision. Yeah, it's this is the sex infusion. I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm not planning on drinking the liquor because I felt like the even the fish was really um, weak. Mm -hmm. Start to have that watery flavor. So probably just have a look at the liquor and not mm -hmm. actually drinking it. I'm So we are ahead and were old者 in need for better personal development. As we were after a while, we were able to get more Cherh Господ all that really become codependent. We started studying studies with telling us a ways to learn from the Jewish people and the Jewish people to understand the Jewish people. 嗯，搿就，还是搿个还是草番薯偏多，还是也是是多的。嗯，搿个来我，你讲其他搿个来我吃哪，基本上是，基本上吃勿很多了。嗯哼，然后再买点草番薯。嗯哼嗯哼。Just a shade darker for the old one. Yeah. Yeah, I want to try at least these two. This one was getting, I found that 2014 was getting watery last time, but uh, the other two weren't so bad. So I'm going to try this one. My backhand pour. And I think we're going to get ready to look at some leaf here. It's not empty yet. Mm -hmm. To me, it doesn't taste empty. So we were just looking at the uh, the brood leaf. Can you be focused? Well, probably. Poke. Should be fine. And uh, we were just noticing that this tea was, um, this is the young one, so the 2014. And you can see the leaf is a, we'll just put a flashlight on it to light it up a bit. The leaf is a little bit lighter. I gotta go that way. Oh, they're all there. Mm -hmm. It wasn't. Oh, yes. Okay, there we go. So the leaf is a little bit mm, towards the green side, we say, even though it's still pretty brown in terms of a, just a general color. But when you come and look at the middle one, you'll see that's much darker uh, than the first one but still with some green. And finally, hopefully you're on there. On the third one, you'll see it's more to the red, brown, like you can see the age versus the color of the brood leaf. So that's what we were just having a look at. Put your back up here. Hello, we're back.